So I played a lot of years of Call of Duty in my life, I would say about either 5 or uh, 40 years. But this has got to be probably one of the worst spawns I've ever seen in Free For All. I was just like, he just popped out all like, sup bruh, what up bruh, how you doing bruh? Like he trying to sell me my mixtape, I was like, nah, chill, chill, I'm trying to do any of that. But I uh, just thought I'd start the video off with that, like that's a pretty weird uh, spawn. But that's not the video topic today, we're talking about camping. And I'll be honest guys, I recorded this commentary before, but for some reason I lost the gameplay. I have no idea where it went, it went in the depths. Like, okay, so you know when you do laundry, right? And you, you're washing your clothes, your shirts, and your socks, like today I just did laundry, right? You know how you always lose at least one? One sock. I guarantee you, you do laundry and you lose one sock. So every like two, you gotta like wait for the next uh, laundry day to lose another sock to even out your socks because you always lose one. You don't know where it went. That's where my gameplay is with is with all of your freaking socks. So. I lost the gameplay, re-recording it, but it does not matter because the topic really relates to what I'm doing in this video and or the gameplay, I mean. And what I'm doing in this gameplay, I'm just beasting right now. I'm gonna be honest, I'm beasting. I'm trying to go for the nuclear. Once I went on that 10 kill streak, I knew, oh man, I'm gonna get on this. And you know, I go on a fairly decent kill streak, but when you see me, you see me just kind of chilling in this little area. You don't see me going in the middle, right? You don't see me running out there like a dingaling, because I just don't feel the need to. People are coming to me. They're coming to Papa. They're coming into my little hotel like thing I don't even know what you would call this in breach would you call it like the, the well obviously this is like the garden area because there's a bunch of plants but in there bro what is this like, I don't even know half the rooms on some of these maps like that's how like weird they are but a lot of these maps are really great I just don't know what they are so we're gonna call this the botanical garden if you guys don't know what this that is I don't know if that's like a worldwide thing or if it's an Arizona thing pretty much it's a beautiful beautiful garden that has a bunch of butterflies in it and like it's just it's just awesome you can hold butterflies make a wish watch them fly away I'm getting off topic I didn't even talk about the topic that's on hand today, camping in Call of Duty. So the reason why that kind of correlates with the gameplay is because you kind of see me just stay in this general area. And in Free For All, that's what, I don't know like if the, you guys do this, but this is what I've been doing ever since Black Ops 1, is just taking control at least of one third of the map. And, my, and I perfected that method back in Modern for 3, because in Modern for 3 Free For All, I would just go for mobs all day, but the way that I would do it is I would take control of at least one fourth of the map. And this is where the kill streak is just, you know, I'm just beasting. I'm calling in my 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 stuff. I think that's a hater as my top. No, that's a lightning strike actually. And I think I'm gonna go for the nuclear. I'm almost already halfway there. And that can't me. Oh, you don't. You see. You see my microphone just going off right there. That's because I was just so pissed. So I just. I was. I was like the Hulk, right? I'm going. I'm angry. I'm going beast mode now. But camping in Call of Duty. What do you? What do you? Okay, so obviously I died and I went on the other side of the map. But now you're gonna see me take control of this side of the map because that's where I just happened to spawn. Would you consider that camping in Call of Duty if you're if you're taking one for, uh, one even one fourth uh, of the map controlling the spawns around that area? Would you consider? Oh man, I just beat that guy in the face, bro. Chris Browned him. Uh, would you consider that camping in Call of Duty? Because me, I'm not trying to die. I I think that's the main part in Call of Duty is that you may be trying to go for kills. But you ain't trying to die, bruh. You ain't trying to die. And when you go in the middle of the map, or you're just trying to run around the whole map in free-for-all, you're gonna die. I guarantee you, if you don't stay at least in one building, you're gonna die. But I wouldn't say you can't camp in, especially in Call of Duty and Black Ops 3, but you can't camp in free-for-all because people will catch on to you and find out where you are. They'll find out where you live in, but first they're gonna find out where you're camping at. So if I were just to stay, like maybe on the staircase the whole entire time, people aren't stupid. They're gonna figure out where I am. So then at that point, I gotta find a new area in the map so that they don't know where I am, so that I can't take them out again. It's just constant moving back and forth in different general areas. I'm taking control of the spawn points, and that's like the main thing that you gotta do in free-for-all. And the only way to do that is not stay in one spot, because they're gonna change different spawns, and if you know where they spawn, like, you gotta figure out how, uh, like, where the map, like, how the map works and how the spawns work, which I think I'm getting, I'm catching on to, you know, they're, they're pretty general. So if I just stay on the edge of the map on the one side and just take control of that then I'm gonna be doing 10 times better than if I'm trying to run around like a little badger trying to get kills here and there so that's just how I play free-for-all you can call it camping I, I honestly I'm not gonna call you dumb if you think I'm camping but uh, me personally camping obviously the definition of actually camping is staying in one spot in like a forest right with little tents marshmallows hot cocoa is optional but I just take it if I'm camping like you can camp however you want camping and call 
example, do you, I say just staying in one general building. Like if I were to stay in this building right here, this exact building right here the whole entire time, that's camping. But if I move from spot to spot to spot to spot to spot, I think that's pretty smart of me. If you call it camping, then I must be camp. I must be the bare grills of camping in Call of Duty. So. Anyway, guys, that's uh, gonna wrap up the video here. I'm trying to get like a trick shot, and look at this! I almost got the no scope for the final kill cam. The suicide! Oh my! Ah oh, man! I, oh man! So I almost got the nuclear. Not really, but it was pretty close. So anyway, guys, that's uh, 30, I think seven or not, whatnot. Uh, quote unquote camping in this game, not really. Come on, bruh. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you want to see more videos like this, talking about just topics in Call of Duty, let me know. I'll be happy to bring them. You know, guys, I love you guys. Thank you guys for watching, and bye.